Le Minimal is absurdly good at football. Le Minimal is one of the best young players on the planet right now. Le Minimal is the next star to win the Ballon d'Or. How to become Le Minimal? First and foremost, one must live by what Le Minimal lives by. Discipline, self-belief and the desire for constant self-improvement. This is how every morning of the 17-year-old Barcelona winger begins. 6.30 a.m. Wake up Like most top athletes in the world, Yamal wakes up early to dedicate as much time as possible to training and reflecting on his football goals. His day starts with a full glass of water, keeping his body hydrated after a night's rest and setting the right tone for the entire day. 6.35 a.m. Yamal does 10 minutes of dynamic stretches like leg swings and arm circles. This way, he warms up his muscles and prepares himself for the intense team training that will follow in a few hours. 6.50 a.m. Yamal sits down for a nutritious breakfast. In about 15 minutes, he fuels his body with proteins from eggs and Greek yogurt, carbohydrates in the form of oatmeal, and fruits like berries, which provide essential vitamins and antioxidants for peak performance and recovery. 7.10 a.m. Lamin performs a small but important ritual before heading to the training ground. He juggles the ball, mentally preparing himself for the hard work ahead at Barca's training complex alongside his teammates. 7.30 a.m. Yamal heads to training. By around 8 a.m., Barcelona's head coach Hansi Flick kicks off an intense session. And Lamin is always noted as one of the hardest working players during every drill and minigame. However, to truly become Le Minimal, you'll still need a little bit of magic. For the Barca Academy graduate, that magical moment came with Lionel Messi's blessing, which Yamal received in his childhood. You probably remember that photo that went viral on social media this summer, right? The one from 2007, where Messi is basing a 5-month-old boy for a charity calendar. That boy was none other than Le Minimal. Back then, his encounter with Leo was purely coincidental, but 17 years later, we see that just a few simple touches from the Argentine had a magical impact on Yamal's future. Now, Lamin is the new main man at Barcelona, and since Messi, no other player at the club has generated as much excitement around their persona as Yamal. No one else, apart from Lamin, has seemed like such a phenomenal talent capable of reaching Messi's greatness. Finally, Barca fans see a worthy successor to Messi standing before them. Being La Minimal means loving football with all your heart. From his childhood, the boy has lived for the game, and the ball has always been his best friend, inseparable from him. I always carried my ball with me, even when I went to school. I would take it with me and keep it until I go to class, and then I would hide it in my bag because the teacher wouldn't let me leave it on the desk recalls Yamal in an interview with France Football. All that little Lamine thought about while growing up was how to become the best version of himself and reach the highest levels in his favorite game. At 13, Yamal decided to perfect one of his skills, and that was his technique. Instead of spending hours in the gym, the Barcelona Youth Academy gym nearly left on the pitch tirelessly working on his first touch, his ability to control and press the ball with any part of his body, his dribbling, and of course, his one-on-one -on -one place. Eventually, between the ages of 12 and 16, Yamal developed an extraordinary level of individual mastery, which we witnessed during Euro 2024 and continue to see in the new club season. At the same time, Lamin is catching up on things he neglected in the past. Under the guidance of Hansi Flick, Yamal finally took his physical condition seriously and quickly built his body up to the level of a fully developed 25-year-old player. The days when strong La Liga defenders could easily push the Barcelona winger off the ball and bully him in duels are over. Yamal is not a joke anymore. Moreover, Lamin always wanted to learn from the best. From his school years, he fell in love with the game of former Barca forwards Neymar and Ronaldinho. We would meet after school at a friend's house because he had a computer and we would put on videos of Neymar. We would spend the whole afternoon watching there. Then I would go to sleep at my house and I would watch it at home in my room. Since then, Lamin Yamal has been driven by a great dream. 
to become as significant a player for the club as Neymar and Ronaldinho once were. And in fact, Yamal is already achieving this. After Hansi Flick's appointment, Lemien stopped being just a promising talent. Now, he is the leader of a new killer Barcelona that is demolishing opponents at the start of the season and securing its first Champions League triumph since 2015. Fans look at Yamal as if he is a deity, praying that he will return Barca to the pinnacle of world football, just as Lionel Messi did in the last decade. And it's truly really insane when you consider that we are talking about a 17-year-old boy, Dave. The expectations of millions of fans are now resting on his shoulders, so it's clear that on this challenging path, Yamal needs to maintain peak performance not only in the field, but also mentally. When I arrived at Barca, I had this individual mastery. I had my own way of playing, but I lacked control over myself. I was a bit of a chaotic player at that time. At La Masia, I learned to be calm, to know when to play fast and when to play slowly, and to play as a team, and everything that makes the Barcelona match special. From an early age at La Masia, they also teach and help us in orienting our life so that you don't go off track in future. They put psychologists in charge of you. Now I'm feeling mentally strong and ready. I try to enjoy the moment because I believe that what is happening to me is something unique. Mundo Deportivo quotes Yamal. Unique is such an apt word to describe Lemin Yamal's career. At just 17, this La Masia prodigy has already been nominated for the Ballon d'Or, an extraordinary achievement that even the goals of football, Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo can't stay silent about. I think that Lemin Yamal, who is still very young and plays for Barca, will play a prominent role and fight for the Ballon d'Or in the future, as Leo is convinced. Yamal has a huge potential. I see a lot of talent. He will be the best player of this new generation, as Cristiano agrees. The kings of football, Messi and Ronaldo, never throw around such praise lightly. If they truly consider Lemin Yamal the best representative of the new era, he certainly deserves it. Yamal's playing style is unique and unparalleled. Here's how football experts describe him. Lemin never knows what decision he will make in the future, but he anticipates it. It's as if he can foresee what will happen on the pitch in mere seconds. His body instinctively senses the space. Even without lifting his eyes or analyzing, he can predict where his teammates and opponents will be moments later. An endless talent of the body. It's unpredictable and geared towards deceiving the opponent. Defenders study the body patterns of attackers, most are similar, and can predict their next moves. Yamal's body language, however, is full of tricks, a dance without rules, an escape from reality. He's light and fast, much like Ronaldinho. Not just an explosive dribbler, knows when to pass. He looks around frequently, scans the field, and chooses the best moment to pass. Quick legs are common, quick minds are few, and the combination of these two qualities, a rarity, is what makes Yamal uniquely unstoppable. Defensive instinct knows when to close in on an opponent to make possession difficult, can wear them out, unexpectedly diving into tackles, committing tactical fouls. This is even an abnormally mature game without the ball for a 17-year-old. Hasn't started taking free kicks yet, soon he'll surprise us there as well. Yamal isn't just a flash in a pen or a lucky player, he's an exceptional talent akin to Ronaldinho. There is a special reverence and care for him. We want to protect him from injuries and anything that could dim his gift. So there you have it, friends, an intriguing description of Lemin's talent, which partially captures his extraordinary phenomenon in top football. Lemin Yamal's journey in football is that of an ordinary boy achieving everything through his own efforts, hard work, and humility. He lives the dream, lives in the moment, looks up to the best, and does everything to become one of them. That's what it means to be Lemin Yamal. I see that there are children who want to look like me, or I see a child wearing my shirt. It seems incredible to me, because when I was little, I looked at Messi or Neymar, and seeing that children now pay attention to me is something amazing. I will never want to leave Barcelona. I want to be a legend here. I just want to leave my mark on football. The most important thing is to leave a legacy, Yamal says. You're on the right track, lad. And your legacy will be unmatched. Lemin Yamal, you are the present and future of football. 
and no one can stop you. Friends, how did you like the new segment on our channel? Let's make a deal. If you enjoyed this video and want a similar one about Cristiano Ronaldo Jr.'s training methods, hit the like button. Once we reach over 2,500 likes on this video, we'll start working on the one about Cristiano's son. Thank you for supporting our content and don't miss out on another incredible talent from La Masia, Ruslan Mba. He might even surpass Lamine. Enjoy watching!